Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Sorry, I forgot to say good night yesterday. It was just, uh, I just came back and then all my friends were here and we're talking. Yeah. You know the drill. <laughs> um, it's crappy weather. So this is the weather right now. I don't think you can see the rain, but you can see here that it's like super wet inside. Um, yeah, so great. Um, they actually talked about a storm like a really bad thing but it seems like it's going away at 3 and I'm flying out 8 p.m. tonight so wish me luck because tomorrow is going to be really exciting in China as well so I don't really have time to stay here and it's so crappy anyway <clears throat> and my throat I need to go back and get some hot tea you know <laughs> So anyway, today is the last day of the conference and I'm super excited again to get started. Yeah, we're going to go downstairs and get some food first and I'm going to check out and then we're going to take an Uber, I think, uh, to the conference center and uh, hear two or three um, other speakers and yeah, let's just go together. So we're now in a conference center again, which is just so amazing. Again, as I said before, the Filipino people are so friendly. It's extreme. Like uh, we went with an Uber cab or like not Uber. They have another app here called Grab. So Grab Taxi. And uh, the guy, he was like opening the doors and saying welcome and thank you very much. They say thank you literally all the time, <laughs> right? Yeah, they, they really do. Um, so that's just amazing. I said like when I go back to China, I'm going to be like, please say thank you because now I got used to it here. You get used to it really, really fast. Um, so anyway, we're going to our first... Uh, <laughs> we're going to our first... Um, what is that called? Oh, speaking... Keynote speech. There we go. We're going to the first keynote speech. Keynote speech very soon, and then we're gonna have like coffee break, and then we're gonna have another speech, and then we're gonna have the lunch break. And the lunch is like to die for. So I'm gonna take you guys with me again. Let's go. Here we go. Agoda and Travel Massive found they're having a Q&A discussion. Here we've got some logos, right? Uh, these are companies that you've, that you've worked with, uh, which are, you know, some of the, the biggest brands in the world. Oh, sorry. Oh, God, I screwed that up. This is Travel Massive's founder. He is playing intern at Agoda. <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> he doesn't know anything. <laughs> uh, um, the cacao is not big anywhere else in the planet. So we're just having the first coffee break of the day and my voice is totally gone, sorry for that. I just said hello to uh, the Agoda founder and that was really interesting. I'm gonna go and sit down and talk to them a little bit later, but first let us have some food. We got lots of different things here. I can't explain what it is, but I can read it for you guys. So here, peachy peachy, grated cassava rolled in grated coconut. We got more coconut, we got sticky rice cake. Uh, I don't really know what I picked. Like, I'm literally just looking at it and then I just choose whatever I feel like and then I just go for it. So yeah, wish me luck on that one. <laughs> He just made me a mango ice cream from this really cool little truck thing. Yeah, I'm very excited. This is a native ice cream, mango flavor, yay! So it seems like they uh, forgot the chairs. Yeah, they forgot the chairs. Uh, Alicia, how are you feeling about that? Just quitting the chairs? Over here. <laughs> we have today, but we don't have chairs. But we don't have chairs. That's kind of weird. Oh, we're not shy, don't worry. We're never shy. Mm. It looks nice, but no chairs. That's like, uh, that's how they, that's how they save money here. We get an impressed, no, not impressed, compressed. Compressed towel here, water, and then boom. It's gonna turn into a towel, they tell me, but I don't believe it. Wow, okay, so this is a mall of Asia. I feel like there's a party in here. Um, I'm gonna go in here to exchange my money back to RMB because I took out way too much Filipino money and I don't need it because we have literally just been at the conference all the time 
and I'm sorry for the noise. Just bought a little something. The waiters are having a party here in front of the restaurant. Yeah. Fun in the Philippines. Okay guys, so I just went to the mall because I was supposed to change my money back to RMB, but that was not possible, so I went shopping instead of. Uh, I bought a few things and now I'm in a cab on my way back to the convention center because I have to leave for the airport very soon, so I'm just gonna go back to say goodbye to the people that I met and hug all of them and say, see you next year, I'll see you in China, and then we're going to the airport so we can fly back to Beijing, yes. So you know, I said, um, that Filipino people are really, really nice and friendly. Well, they are, but do never take a taxi here because I asked the taxi driver first, are you gonna put on the taxi meter? He said yes, and then he put it on. And then when I came here, he still fooled me. He was like, you have to pay this amount of money. And I was like, that's insane. That's more than what I pay when I go to the airport, which was like insane already. And then he gave me a better price, but he was still fooling me so much. Like that's worse than China. I don't like that. So guys, if you're ever gonna go here, use Uber or Grab Taxi because the taxi drivers, they fool you. So remember that when you look foreign or if you look like you have money, yeah, not cool. Anyway, I'm back now, so I'll try to be happy. Wow, so I'm back again. I'm probably gonna eat a few of these and try to forget my bad experience in the taxi. Looks delicious and sweet. So everyone is just like mingling and socializing and making deals with different people and businesses. Really, really interesting. You see they're all working really hard. And you can have free coffee and water, which is amazing. And green tea, of course. We are in Asia, right? Wow, okay, so that was it for now. I am right now just getting ready, waiting for my Uber drive, because I'm going to the airport and going back to Beijing. So first, I'm really excited for Beijing because of the weather. I'm excited to go back and start some really, really interesting things tomorrow. But on the other hand, I also am going to miss this because it was amazing. I learned so much and met so many amazing people. So yeah, I'm definitely going to be back next year. Wow, okay, that's serious shit. Like, I think the... Um, Gods, there they just checked the back of my Uber car, and I think this is my Uber. So, yay, let's go to the airport. So we're back at the airport again. Um, again, the security is crazy. Again, but on the other hand, like it's quite nice, and you know that you're safe, or I hope so. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna go in here. I'm flying with Sabre Pacific today, so I'm excited to see how that's gonna be like, and uh, yeah. Just enjoying a little bit of YouTube before I'm going back to China. It's amazing. I'm gonna miss it again.